Hello folks, with the standard digital servo worms, I have achieved landing lights. I have a dual battery set up. This is running my gimbal. It is grounded through the controller. Um, this is running the NASA uh, and the PMU. I have no ESCs uh, powering up my receiver. The only thing that is powering up my receiver is the uh, PMU. However, I wanted to have lights on the re on the uh, landing skids coming down, and with one of the turnigy switches, I was able to get the lights to come on in the retract position. But that's opposite of what I needed. So I found this little switch that I will post in the details that controls just the ground. And it does not create a ground loop. I have, in fact, uh, tested it extensively by unplugging the X3 from the PMU. I get it. Uh, there is no uh, voltage going back to the receiver. And the reason is, is this is a diode-protected switch. So I have basically got this light powered up with a small resistor so that it doesn't get too hot. It's... Uh, working great I can post the details of that resistor as well and that goes straight to hot positive and then my negative is going to my switch which is controlled with a Y splitter that also goes to my retracts which I will plug in here okay I uh, have one of my retracts is burnt up through uh, trying to come up with a solution for landing gear lights, uh, my thoughts was reversing the servo, and uh, that didn't work out. So I've only got one light. Let's let's plug in everything here. Yeah. All right. This is powering the gimbal. The gimbal's powered up. Uh, let's move this back here. Now, through this switch, even in the off position, the light is barely going to be illuminated. It actually looks brighter than it is, you can see that. And the neat thing is, is that you have to go up. So in other words, your lights will not be on when you first power up the machine. But when you retract your gear, which, and then let them... What I wanted was for my landing gear's lights to not be on during power up so i have my landing gear is set to this switch and it, in the down position indicates that my landing gear is down so uh as with takeoff that's the way it's going to be when you first plug it up so let's plug in my 4s lipo and you can see that my retracts is down but the light is off okay kind of what i wanted so when putting the landing gear up let me uh, set this back. And I say that the uh, light is off. It is actually very dimly lit because this switch actually does not. It, there is some ground bleed over, which is okay. It's just very dimly lit. You'll see how much brighter it gets here. So I'm going to flip this up. All right, one of my retracts is messed up i'm waiting for a replacement servo and i'm going to flip this down Try to position this right here there we go. Yeah, let's just set it like that need a third hand all right so um See that it lights up the ground pretty good. Off, on. Some people may have a uh, little to say about the the about the dim lit LED. Um, I think with some of the LEDs that would not happen. Um, and you have the option of just powering straight through the switch here you could uh, use your this switch is providing a 5 volt source which 
I just wanted more. I didn't want a 5 volt LED. I wanted uh, uh, about a 12 volt LED. Hence the reason I used a uh, resistor to pull some of the voltage down from this 4 cell IPO that I'm using, which made that light very hot. So um, this is perfect. Um, it, it doesn't get too hot. It's very bright. And, uh, and I'm not hardly using any amp pulls, it seems. It's not affecting my flight time at all. So, any comments? Thanks, guys.